something that so-called Democrats, that is, those are socialists, need to understand is that every time they have mentioned the word impeachment during the time that they failed the people, during the time that they failed the people, that is, during the time of Trump's administration, because they've just wasted their time and everyone else's time by talking about impeachment, which will never happen. Every time they've talked about impeachment, that has cemented and sealed thus their doom and the upcoming 2020 presidential election. I hope they understand that when it's all said and done, when Donald J. Trump is reelected, they know full well that the reason why is that they could not shut the fuck up about impeachment. So in the meantime, in the interim, every time they talk about impeachment, one of these media hacks echoes, reverberates, resounds, sounds off, plays it over the loudspeaker, the megaphone, Every time one of these fucking peons, morons, mentions the word impeachment, just sit back to yourself, man, and laugh at these absolutely fucking ridiculous piece of shit assholes, knowing that the only one who is going to be impeached is them. That's right. They have set themselves up for the ultimate downfall in 2020, politically speaking, in that they are the ones who steadfastly holding to their narrative and their notion helped get Donald Trump reelected. Now keep in mind, these motherfucking idiotic, preposterously fucking goonish, ghoulish, Stupid as all get out, motherfuckers, have zero, the number null, zero, which is no number. They have zero knowledge that they are doing what in fact they are doing. And I am referring to the unintended consequence of they themselves helping to get Donald Trump reelected. That's what's going to happen. And and they helped it happen. They're so motherfucking ludicrous. They have no idea. They have no idea because they're arro- they're arrogant. They're conceited. They're egotistical. They're outlandish. They're outrageous. And they're politically blinded by their own absolute maximum stupidity. They are truly fucking delusional. Everything they shout, everything they broadcast, oh, Trump is so immature. He's such a toddler. He's such a a grown toddler baby man. He's so infantile and puerile. We're dealing with the president who is unsteady, and perhaps even schizophrenic. You know the shit they do where they like to mischaracterize and they like to mislabel people with all of their Nazi babble? Because that's what they fucking are. They're actually fascists. They think it's okay and it's totally fucking kosher to trot around the globe, to go around the planet, run amok, and mislabel people as being delusional and crazy. Oh, and Donald Trump, he's totally off his rocker. He's a totally crazy man. Yeah, he's out of his mind. We're dealing with the president who is, he's hes not fit for office. No, he has psychiatric and mental illness issues. You know what's going to happen to these fucking people, man? Who want to be fucking Nazis? You know what's going to happen to these people that talk like that, man? You know what's going to happen to these motherfuckers who think it's okay 
to talk like that, here's what's going to happen. Everything that they are trying to project is what they actually are. You have to be delusional and you have to be pretty much fucking insane to make up the type of stories and immature bullshit that these people talk about on a daily fucking basis. You have to be an immature person as an adult to make up the types of make-believe stories, fables, fallacious tales, tall tales, fish fucking tales, fish stories, the goddamn types of story time, pretend time, play time type fucking shit these people talk about. You have to be an immature bastard as an adult to sit around and talk the way that they talk. These people think in their minds that they can bring about Donald Trump's downfall by behaving like the immature little fucking kids that they actually are. And you know what's going to happen, man? An entity far more powerful than the juggernaut Donald Trump, who has been, in fact, a juggernaut because they've tried to take him down to no avail. The system, the system that they extol and that they proselytize where anyone and anyone can just be made out to be delusional and crazy. Popeye, Popeye, cuckoo. Donald Trump is totally mentally ill. He's totally schizophrenic. We're dealing with the president who is mentally unfit for office. They're going to end up living in a system where they're controlled in that same way that they are attempting to control. The control that they are trying to project is the Orwellian, the Orwellian system where they can and will be targeted in that precise same, exact, exact same way.